You can tell me what they do, what they do, how they dress, me how they dress. And that is the final look you guys i think it came out super cute now let me get into how i prepare my aloe vera oil okay but how rude is it for this person to start cutting grass as i'm about to start filming like you can wait brown skin girl your skin just like pearls you're back against the world i never trade you for anybody else say eh? brown that's the famous one. In fully He's in England. Right, um, yeah. He went back to the other day. He's in Did you come back? Yeah, Tisman. I wouldn't have been in the club. I just sent a message to him. Message Roy. And that's him. Where is he? That's him. It's the glow for me. Say hi, Daddy. Hi. <laughs> hi. Is your daddy? Babe, like, hi. Hi. It's the glow for me. Like, the glow. <laughs> She's a player to drink one, my sister. Let's get back. What oh, was yours? What's your drink? Oh, let's go. First thing on a bowl like them full of gun, heavy clip full of crocodile teeth. Everything get fucked when I reach. Sixteen on a boy skin. Head tap, bust up and split. Say your bad pussy will run up and sit. Yeah, E. You're on the left side. Yeah. 
Cause once you get inside, you can't change your mind. I don't mean a silent patient, but you gotta follow space. Tell me again. What's up, Divas? Today is Sunday the 18th. Yes, Sunday the 18th of September. I'm just waking up. Forgive me. I was out late last night. I didn't get drunk, but your girl was out late. So listen, today is I'm going to the um today I'm going to the spa. So I'm going to Cambridge Beaches Spa today and then I'm gonna hang up by the pool for a little bit. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get food there, but then I mean my sister hanging up for the rest of the day. Pray for me because she know how to act. She's had me all weekend, so I hope she's happy. You know, we're good on the trip soon. So this is probably the last time she gets me her one on it before we leave. But anyway, we're going to spa day today, and I'm going to bring you guys along with me. This is the first time I've actually been to this particular spa at Cambridge Beaches. So, yeah, hopefully it's nice, and I enjoy myself. Generally, spas for me are always good. So... I'm going to take you guys along with me, show you what it's all about, hope you like it, hope I like it, and that's real. Alright, so we're on our way to the spa, and it's about 5 minutes away from, oh, hold on. It's about 5 minutes away from where we live, so a certain person didn't know how to wake up on time, so she's making us leave. But yeah, I stayed here for my, um, the same place I stayed for my birthday vlog, but that, mm, yes, go check it out, um, because that was like my first one from the beginning of the year. I stayed at the same place, but I never went to the spa. I wanted to go to the spa, but I never made it because yeah oh no i think they was either closed or i just wasn't able to make an appointment so never made it to the spa for my birthday time but we're just gonna go check them out now So with my sis and we're about to go inside now excited she doesn't know how to get in her bed at night so she's tired me on the other hand I'm straight That'll be us. Perfect. Come through and have a seat here. Unfortunately, we have no hot water in the changing rooms at okay. the moment. So okay. they're going to take you straight through to the rooms to get changed. Okay. That's what I'll say. Yeah. And then here. And my hair is
what's up diva so i just decided to sit down here and do my makeup with you all um going to a day party but it's like an inside day party not an outside day party i know i don't know who decided to put it inside as best outside but whatever it's like a club inside day party so yes i am going to sit here it's got to be a little quick look i'm got well roughly 40 minutes to get ready 30 40 minutes to get ready so it's gonna be a quick little um soft glam look i guess you could call it soft glam is the same thing to me as natural glam but not too glam just a little something that i consider to be put me together you know to look cute anyway hope you guys like this i'm not going to talk through it i'm just going to do a little montage i think that's what it's called look at me trying to use my terms anyway stay tuned should i put one lip gloss or not but i know i'm a lip gloss girl so this is just gonna put on her lip gloss because why not and this fancy glass slipper mm, get this your lips like be popping can you see the shine can't do no wrong let me put on my lashes Am I close? I need this. It's gonna be a red D. And that is the final look.
look you guys i think it came out super cute you know i was going for that soft look and so i didn't do any shadow i just took my um bronzer my fancy bronzer and i put that on my eyelid and then yes that was pretty much it and i think she looks super cute and flawless and effortless and my battery is about to die the disrespect so i see you guys when i go take some pictures and then i'm going to a party so i'm going to take you guys with me see you in a bit what's up divas good morning so today is mm, today is september the 23rd lies the 22nd tomorrow the 23rd um it, it is a thursday and i'm starting off this vlog i'm gonna exercise i think it's gonna be more so a mini vlog because i'm due back to work on saturday today is thursday but i wanted to check in with you guys because i want to record what this whole tropical storm hurricane category four fiona is gonna do to our island into the horizon if you look from my house um it's a bit gloomy it looks rainy but it's not raining here on island in the western end just yet so when you guys see my little horizon shots this is where i'd be looking at them from so i'm going to keep you guys abreast of this hurricane and as it approaches the island it's not supposed to be at its closest point until 5 a.m tomorrow morning so they're thinking that it's going to be at its strongest i mean it's going to be most damaging actually late this evening into the early hours of the morning like two three o'clock but like i said not supposed to reach its closest point until five so yeah i'm gonna start off my day by doing some exercise and then we will get into what the rest of the day entails First minute done. Alrighty. Work out done. Tired. Period. Sweaty mess. But I got in here. Today was actually supposed to be my rest day, but I woke up and I was ready to get in a workout, so I just went ahead and did it, being that I was in a good mood to get done because. If you work out, you already know every day ain't a good day and you gotta push through it. But, I've got my work that's on 30 minute workout today. What I do, glutes and core, cool. working on my booty. So, yeah, now I'm just gonna have some breakfast. Rotate away from it. 
stack them over top, kick. There you go, feel the difference? Let's go four, two, one, and breathe and grab some water. We're going on to a unilateral lunge to knee drive. So we started back here, here, making sure you're not just rolling over it. Routine. Nice work. Take a rolling off that front heel, toe up. Rest. Great job. Two more rounds of that. I think everyone's gonna guess this one. Mountain climbers times five and an open up. Open. You go five again, open to the other side. Okay? Two, one, let's go. And now I'm going to use the rest of my aloe. Oh. Didn't I say my face looked a little bit weird, strange? Maybe, maybe not on camera. So I'm actually now doing my aloe vera face mask. I did look up those properties. So I'll be leaking those properties right here. Over here somewhere, I'm gonna list those properties of the aloe vera um, on the skin and what its benefits are, but very good. So I'm gonna try and do at least twice a day. When my day is off, I'm gonna try and get in three times a day. Cause when I was reading, it did say that a study was done with it being done four times a day. I don't know if I'm gonna be that good, but I'll try and do at least three times a day. So now let me get into how I prepare my aloe vera oil. Once again, I'm gonna use my handy dandy blender to blend. And then to this, I'm just gonna add the jelly. I use this already for my face. I'm gonna continue to use it because I'm not throwing away all of this good, good jelly. As you can see, all of this content here is what I want to go inside of my thing. Actually, I take that back. I generally put the whole thing inside and blend. So I'm going to take the remainder of my, I have more outside in my garden, so I'm not too concerned about using this up, but I'm gonna go ahead and use it. It's a nice piece and it has a lot of jelly. I generally cut off the very end part like that. And then I go ahead and cut off these stems. If that's called stems, I take that off. Um. Once I take the sides off, then I'm just going to go ahead and cut it into smaller sections so that it can fit inside my blender. Because at this size, she not going to fit inside my blender. Um, I already soaked this, so let me show you. So I'm going in, I usually use olive oil, but I don't have any olive oil. So I'm just going to go ahead with this avocado oil by Chosen Foods. And I generally put enough in just to cover my um, aloe. But because I'm using two oils, I'm going to go in with two different types. So I don't have to cover it completely. So that's how much it is. And then I'm going to go in with my coconut oil in Nativa. Oh, I can't get it open. Okay, there we go. So I'm just going to add this in until I cover my aloe. That's about it. I would generally add some tea tree oil, but I don't have any. So... That's it right there. That's my base. Let 
Make that nice and tight. Okay, give that a good blend. So this next step requires me to boil it down. So I'm gonna put my stove on. I'm gonna start off at medium to bring it to a boil and then I'll reduce it. This is that consistency, what it's looking like, very thick. So I'm just gonna boil this down. Okay, so I am back and my oil is finished. Final product, you can see it's all clumped together, leaving me with just the oil. So I'm going to let this cool down and then I will strain it. All right, so let me come to this side. The brother has ish started to make up a little bit not really too windy a little bit of rain like a few minutes ago but still pretty good and we'll hit it on 315 so not too bad at all let me let me go ahead i just finished taking some pictures of sweaty girls eyebrows done i wanted to go outside and try to take some content but of course it decided to start sprinkling soon your girl had to make it happen inside with that said let me show you what this oil is looking like it's dry dry it's cool down now and as you can see the aloe vera clumps together when you move it to eat to one side so I'm gonna go ahead and strain this out and show you how I bought it
it's a little later in the day, about 4.30. I had to shoot some content, wanted to go outside. Couldn't go outside because of the weather. It's not raining, but it's just gloomy. It wasn't bright enough to me. So I just shot some content inside my house. And then I went ahead and um, cooked me up a quick meal. I should have showed you guys how I really... So let me show you all what we're looking like. Hopefully it don't fall. This is what we're looking like. So just some grilled fish, pan fried seared fish, I should say, over a bed of broccoli. I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. I'm not sure if I said it already, but I am like partially keto. I try not to eat, I try not to eat um, a lot of carbs. As I said before, I got a trip that I gotta get myself together for. So this is gonna be my late lunch. I might eat again around about eight or nine, but yeah, this is gonna be it. And then I'll be good for the night. So, see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so I just came down to my parents' house and we're here just playing a game. I actually did want to go and check the water because the tide usually comes in real high. But anyway, we're just down here playing what is called trouble and um thank you just on her playing trouble and yeah i told you i'm right here don't know you have to go up here first that's what it says there is not yeah so the instructions it says you have to go to the top first Come on, Tim. Oh, it's not gonna add up. Watch. I need a snack. Yeah, Tasha, I'm gonna get some cheese. Come on. Watch. You can't put your slide up there. Watch. It's my turn, isn't it? Tasha, you ever heard of something? You just slide up there? No, you can't do that. Watch. Watch the instructions. Can you push that move one? We come out. You yeah. can't move. Well then how you want me to get in there? You just said you, you can. Have to no, you you have to come here and you have one. to get like one, two, three, four. Right, one you have to allow, stay there. And allows out to come yeah, out. you can't move on one. Oh my god. You guys are foolish. You guys are playing this game all wrong. How do you go? I didn't even get my turn yet. Well good, bro. what's up divas welcome back to my channel it is your girl natasha danielle today is september 27th i believe and it is good and well 2 30 in the afternoon i've been up for probably about two hours now um it's starting off a little bit late only because i had to try and get up my mini vlog and go check that out i'm gonna put a little being up over her so you can click that and they'll come back to this vlog so it's a couple days after hurricane fiona and bermuda as usual pulls through quite well so today is a nice a beautiful sunny day outside like a sunny sunny beautiful day outside so right so i have quite a few things that i have to get sorted out today i am off for two days today and tomorrow i'm not scheduled to be into work until thursday but then 
I think I'm working for two days and then I'm off the weekend and back to work. And guess what? Your girl is going on a trip next week. So, countdown is on. Not taking off these braids until it's time for, to, for me to get my hair redone. Because, sis, for what? Too much work. Girls to get it, get it. Um. So, yes. A few things on my list. I have a list that I wrote down. Oh, what else I have to add to this? Oh. Cause you guys gotta write down a list to make sure that she gets everything done in the day when she's off because my day is off is my day is off i work 12 hour shifts so everything's gotta get done on my days off so first things first my daddy asked me to make him some broccoli soup because um he had the tooth extraction so he wants some soup and so i'm gonna take you with me along the way to go grocery shopping for that because i'm gonna make him broccoli soup i might as well make myself soup as well i prefer my pumpkin soup i'm gonna get stuff for that so yeah, let me turn on my phone i'm on hold anyway let me turn on my phone so i'm her right actually i came out the shower and I don't know what I done, but some way, somehow, I saw on my phone where um, I had a copyright claim. That's what. what Thank you so much for waiting online. Like this. So, uh, the hour check and your card is good to go. As you said it, and you can try to make the purchase again. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Yes. Thank you so much for connection with you. But we don't have a wonderful day, miss. Okay. Thank you. Enjoy your day. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. So right, as I was saying, I was in the restroom some way, somehow, I saw that it was a copyright claim on my last vlog that I just posted for you guys. And so I'm like, how I got a copyright claim? That doesn't make any sense. I know I didn't use any copyright music. Anyway, I used this, um, I used this website called Epidemic Sound for all of my music that I use on YouTube so that I don't get a copyright claim. It is a subscription, $15.00. So I don't have to worry about getting claims and strikes on my page. Um, shout out to Aaliyah. Aaliyah's face on YouTube. She gave me that little jam. <laughs> Thanks, boo boo. So um, I'm on there and I'm like, well, what the heck is this copyright claim for? Go into it on my music from Epidemic Sound. So because it's a subscription, so because it's a subscription, you have to keep your subscription up to date. I don't know how it keeps on getting kicked out because it's not the first time it's happened to me, but it's like it doesn't automatically renew. It's like it has to ask me to renew in order for it to renew. So when I post my next video, if it's not within dates, then it expires, which only makes sense, right? So yeah, I'm going on her now to... So I'm going on her now to um, renew the subscription and my car is not working. I'm like, well, I don't got money in my account because it's only got $15. I mean, it did it cost $16. Anyway, quality bank, all of that squashed, solved, resolved. So now I'm good to go because I'm going to place an order and I'm going to go to the grocery store. Can you imagine if I didn't even look at this and call before I went to the grocery store? I would have been at the counter trying to buy groceries and my car didn't work. You know what? I would have been pissed. So anyway... Let me get to the grocery store because it's a good three something in the afternoon now. Let me see. Yeah, it's quarter to four actually in the afternoon. So let me get going because you saw the list that I gave and I haven't checked off anything yet. Yeah, I need to get going. I'm going to go bring you guys with me and yeah, see you in the car. to the grocery store and don't laugh at me for having um i don't have a um thing for my for my camera in my car i put one in my box in my bag online my amazon prime bag but your girl hasn't ordered it yet so 
this lighting is just like not the best at all but i'm on my way to the grocery store i still had to end up eating actually i should have been there and back but i was starving because all i had was my protein shake after i worked out so i'm going to the grocery store now and now it's a good 4 20 in the afternoon so yeah but no worries we're gonna get through the day we still got time we still got time i should have at least finished my finished cleaning and installing my wig at this point but it is what it is so let's run in the grocery store real quick Okay, but how rude is it for this person to start cutting grass as I'm about to start filming? Like, you can wait. So anyway, I'm back home from the grocery store and um, I'm about to put a little, a little of laundry in the washer and clean up my kitchen a little bit. I just don't like seeing stuff around. Um, it's not like messy, dirty, but I just don't like seeing stuff around. I think I feel like a glass of wine to be honest or a drink so I might pour up or something I'm waiting for my sister to reach home with the rest of the items for the soup and then I'm gonna clean my wig that I plan on putting on and then I guess to prepping the meals and then y'all will see how things go but that's the general order that I'm looking for so let me go ahead and put some clothes in the laundry all right so I told you all that i wanted to make a drink so i just finished cleaning up my um living room a little bit because i do have to start recording after i do my hair and makeup it is now um five to six so roughly that's a good time for me i'm not going outside to take any pictures all my pictures will be done inside and i'll just end up using my lighting for that so i'm not worrying about the sun going down at all mind you good and all right now is top term so yeah drink of choice is pineapple ciroc ginger beer this is actually a Bermudian soda so I top it up with this soda and then I put some regular oil pulp no pulp orange juice and then I say this drink hits oh my good grief it hits I don't know if you got any ginger beer where you're from they got a Caribbean store asking for gingerbread. They may have it. 
because I know there are some places in the States as well and as Canada that also has it as well. But get you some gingerbread. Mm. It's my favorite. Nobody can tell me that this drink don't taste well. Like thumbnail. So yes. I'm gonna be drinking this like it's juice. And I'll be tap and not being able to function to do my content. So this is not supposed to be one of those nights, but it's so well. So good, so easy to make. My ingredients for my pumpkin and broccoli soup is pretty straightforward. I have some broccoli, garlic, scallion, thyme, um, peppers, squash and my pumpkin and then I don't use regular um, cow's milk I use coconut cream um, love the coconut cream as a I love the coconut cream as a replacement for cow's milk cow's milk because a lot of people don't well I have a best friend that's vegan so I made it once before but he couldn't have none so I said since then I'm just going to replace it with coconut cream and it kind of gives it that same consistency as um, heavy cream would but it's just that it's not cow's milk. So love that if you don't like coconut it does give it a coconut flavor I must say but the smooth velvety mm, wow okay well that's how i like it i'm just saying so i'm gonna go ahead and get started chopping up these items and i roast them first i put everything up and roast it to pre-cook and then i boil it down so let me show you Because I know I'm making it for, though my daddy asked for it, it's going to be for everybody. So I'm just going to go down there to see if they have any more hairs of broccoli. And then I'm going to do this and pop them in the oven. And the only thing I add to them is salt and pepper. That is. And olive oil. Can't you be? 
this is what we're looking like. This is the double broccoli because it's going to be for more people. And then my pumpkin and squash fit into one. And then I also roast the peppers, garlic, and scallions. And like I said, everything only gets oil, olive oil, salt, and pepper. Yum, yum. Going all to different places, different planets. But your aura passed me by, losing balance. What if we run out of time and second chances? Empty handed. You like to fast life. You like to drive and get down and dirty. I like got the bad guy. You want some love, you like when you feel like calling me. Be watching no, Judge Judy. Just so you did have a headstone. So she watches. That was a headstone. Mm -hmm. It was a um, gifted one. I don't care if it was gifted or not. It was a headstone. What the last name spelled wrong. Well, spelled you know what you're wrong? doing? It, it came a, right from now. a family. <laughs> <It's just laughs> you don't make it for him. Too many. He huh? has two you middle names. Christopher Paul oh, Daniel, yeah. the middle yeah. last name. Yeah. What else do you want? These are the findings of the court after a full trial. Although the parties never married, they lived together for the first two years of life and we're engaged Thing to you i'm reading <gasps> you have another child from another that's cute no you were a die high with that of course oh yeah Oh no, I heard my nephew and my, and my mama arguing. Let's go see what they're up to. And what rules were they supposed to No, my nephew. Yeah, it's hot out there. 
Daddy! This is how my roast vegetables this hardy roasted vegetables have come out. Now I'm just going to pop them both into the pot and I'll show you what I do. You depend on my weakness. Satisfying you when I keep bleeding.
trying to fall through I'ma leave it up to you What you wanna do? Look, I'm trying to spend this time with you No, we all for do what you're doing right now. right now Baby, won't you swing my way? It's been a day and I've been thinking all oh, long I know I want you Long time since the last time Got a tab, we can run up Knew you from the way, now we grown up My look, yeah, made the realest ones nervous But if you want it, tap it it up and then I add that in last because I don't like to blend it the consistency matches up to me so I'm just gonna stir it That's my pot of broccoli soup and it tastes so freaking good. Love this recipe. Don't know where I got it from. I think I got it from somewhere and then just tweaked it myself to be honest. But she tastes so good. The roast vegetables really give it a whole bunch of flavor. So love this recipe. I'll show you the pumpkin one shortly. I was now I'm paid by the sentence Taking my time with it Baby give me yours So I could get some butterflies trapped in your rib cage Let me know we on the same page Give me with a text voice note or an emoji Waiting all day for your name on the ID So if you want it, tap in I think that I know somewhere that we could go to crash in So I like my um pumpkin soup to be like extra smooth creamy silky so i always go a step further and i'm just gonna use my nutribullet and blend it up so it could be extremely smooth not watered down but smooth so it's still a little bit thick like that puree baby food thickness but i don't want it to have that much texture to it so watch what i do you'll see what i do
actually think of me is less than you Just wish that I knew how something like that could happen Maybe it's just in passing, cause nothing is everlasting, no So I finished making my pumpkin soup. She tastes well, of course, because I made it dull. So I just have it on simmer now on the stove. And as you saw me, I just gradually added in that cream. As I said, I don't like to blend the cream because it gives it, it messes with the consistency to me. So I have it on simmer, on low. And I'm just gonna let that simmer let them um flavors just blend and infuse into the pumpkin and yes it's just good to eat now however as you can see i still look the same it's the same put on a wig neither has she did no um clothing haul so it's getting late i went downstairs for longer than i was supposed to it's 10 o'clock now oh. all right so it's just finished her pumpkin soup this is what it's looking like nice and smooth and velvety and nice and rich you're gonna taste this part of soup what is it because do you guys call this soup i call this soup but it's nice now that we're transitioning into fall this is fall soup it's pumpkin spice soup like what okay all my caribbean jamaicans don't sound off because you're always telling me at work this ain't a part of soup worse the rest of the stuff you ain't never had a delicate part of soup like everything's got to have dumplings. I'm just saying. Everything don't have to have dumplings. I'm going to look like a dumpling if I always ate dumplings. So, let's taste it. That tastes so well. Nobody can tell me any different. That tastes so well. Like, the spice is just enough. And then that cinnamon and nutmeg. Mmm. You have to try it. 